parent of a child who has recently taken to calling themselves heartosexual? Well, I'm Hannah Hart, and I'm here to explain to you what exactly that might mean. As you may or may not know, I run a show on YouTube called My Drunk Kitchen. Now that show is not a celebration of alcoholism. Instead, I prefer to think of the kitchen as a metaphor for life. You see, it's really a show about effort and acceptance. Giving it your all, and then super messing up, but then kind of being proud of yourself in the end anyway. At least you tried. Now, to be fair, I do drop the occasional F-bomb. And some fucking motherfucking eggs. <laughs> But I think you and I both know that there's worse things in this world than some well-timed, completely appropriate profanity. What was the last time you cooked without swearing? Think about it. But there is so much more to being a heartosexual than just simply enjoying my drunk kitchen. Though if you do enjoy it, you have excellent taste and a great sense of humor. Being heartosexual means embracing productivity, even though that your disposition is not necessarily that of the most disciplined person. Eat veggies. Live past 40. Become White Oprah! A third element of being heterosexual is giving a damn about the world around you. Understanding that this life we are given is not just made up of your own personal self-centered universe, but rather about how this universe interacts with the multiple universes around you. By universe, I mean other people. An example of that is along the Hello Harto Travel Show, we are going to be doing meetups at charity events, volunteering together, and raising awareness for the communities around us. Like this one at the LA Food Bank. It was great! And lastly, the final element of being heterosexual that I would like to discuss here today is personal acceptance, patience, and love. We give ourselves probably a harder time than we give anyone else around us. And as someone who struggles with having good boundaries and lifting myself up, I like to share my lessons with those who watch my channel. So if you want to know more about me personally, go ahead and click on any of these videos. In this one, I'm coming out and being like, blah, 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 feelings parade. In this one, I'm talking about how to be a better version of yourself and more productive. And in this one, I'm getting really, really drunk and cooking in my kitchen. So there you have it. Being heterosexual has very little to do with sexuality in general. It's more of a philosophy. A philosophy of love. Oh, that's sweet. If your child has shown you this video, be pretty proud, because you have a kid that really cares about whether or not you understand the things they're into right now. That's great. My little sister's 15. But we get along really great. I love her so much. Maggie, if you're watching this, I love you so much! Thanks for watching! Mwah! This is a show that's about friendship.